And I'm back with another Gate of Infinity rankings. Today we're checking out Revenge and Resurrection from 813 to 820. Now keep in mind, this is the last Gate of Infinity rankings we're going to be seeing coming from the Hyperboost server, as Gate of Infinity will be closed by the time they end the Hyperboost. As always, I'll be taking a look at the top 10 time trials for all weapon combinations. Something like Greatsword and Wand that only has six time trials I'll be ignoring for the data. And here we have our average times for today with Dagger and Crossbow at 6.9 seconds. And Greatsword and Staff at the bottom with a 1 minute and 27 second kill time. Next are minimum and maximum kill times. That's the 1st and 10th place. Dagger and Crossbow at the top with a 3.7 second kill time. And in 10th place, an 8.2 second kill time. Longbow and Wand down at the bottom with a 35 second kill time. And in 10th place, a 55.9 second kill time. And as always, I'll point out that something like Crossbow and Wand and Greatsword and Staff have much larger 10th place kill time. So that skews their average a little bit. And for average week-by-week -week changes, I've got all of the rankings so far up on this same chart. This chart can be a little difficult to read, so I'm going to go ahead and drill down into the top 10. And here at the top 10 for today, we can see a few weapons got a little bit faster. Dagger and Longbow, Sword and Shield and Greatsword. A few things stayed roughly the same, but we do have Crossbow and Longbow getting a little bit slower this week. And even Dagger and Crossbow getting slower, but still significantly faster than the rest of the weapons. Here's all of the raw data that I used for today, if you'd like to look at that information. I have a link below to this spreadsheet, as well as the week-by-week -week changes. This has been Dead Man Fred, and if you're as passionate about gaming as I am, please like and subscribe to my channel for further guides and adventures.